Hi guys and welcome to next unboxing and assembly instruction video from Mini Bike Store video blog. In today's video I'm gonna show you step by step how to properly assemble the top of the range electric mini quad. This is the Maddox Deluxe Extra Extra Large 1300 Watt. The Maddox Deluxe comes in three different versions. We have the version with 1000 Watt 36 volt electric motor. We have the version with 1000 Watt 36 volt and lithium ion batteries. And this is the most powerful version with 1300 Watt electric motor and 48 volt lithium ion battery. So let's open the box and see what is inside. So here it is how the quad looks like outside the cardboard box. As you can see it's a well packed, it's well secured in the steel frame. So we deliver the squad on the pallet so it should arrive safe to your home. So now step by step I will show you how to properly assemble the quad. So first you will need to remove all the attached parts. Here we have the rear wheel. And the second one on this side. Here is the box with parts. So let's open the box and see what we get with the quad. Here in this box we have the charger. We have the toolkit. We have the user manuals for the quad in English language. We have the bolts, fuses, the front mud guard here and the caps for the wheels. So first we need to start from disassembling the frame. So you need to remove all the bolts which hold the frame together. Now you can remove the top of the frame. Next cut the plastic tie just here. and unwrap the quad. Unwrap the handlebars. You will need to start assembly from installing the handlebars. So here in the back we have the clamps and the bolts for the handlebars. So prepare the four clamps and four bolts. Put one of the clamp on the bottom, just like this. One on the top. And insert the bolt through it. And the second bolt. Now insert the second clamp at the bottom. One on the top. And the bolt through it. Place the handlebars on the middle. Just like this. And tighten the bolts well. Next cut the wire just here which holds the quad into the metal frame. Remove the wire. Also cut the wire just here on the back or untwist it and remove this wire. Now you will need to lift and remove the quad from the metal frame and place it on the stand. Once you have the quad placed on the stand, just like this, for easy installation, you need to cut the plastic tie just here. Remove the front bumper, which is just here. Next, remove these four bolts. and install the bumper.
and tighten well all four bolts. Next remove this bolt here and connect the front shock absorber. Secure it with the nut and tighten the nut well. We highly recommend that you check the top bolt as well, make sure it's tight. And now connect the shock absorber at the other side. The next step is to install the front wheel. So remove this long bolt here. Insert the wheel in position. Put the bolt through it. And secure it with the nut on the bottom. And tighten the nut well. Now install the wheel on the other side. Next you will need to connect the steering rod on both sides. So first remove the nut from the bolt. Next connect the steering rod. Put the washer first and then the nut. And now tighten the bolt well. Next connect the steering rod from the other side. So now we have the front of the quad fully assembled, we can move to the back. At the back of the quad we just have to install the rear wheels, so remove the nuts on both sides. Prepare the wheels. Here we have the left hand side. Here we have the right hand side wheel. Put this washer first, then this washer, and then the nut. Tighten the nut well. And insert the pin through the hole here to secure the nut. Bend the pin. Do the same on the other side. Next, install the caps on the wheels. So now the quad is fully assembled and we can test the quad. So first you need to connect this main cable into the battery pack, just here. Here we have the main ignition, so we can turn the ignition on. Here it shows us what the battery life. Here we can turn on and turn off the lights, so let's check it. The light is working. Let's check the rear light brake light and also the position light so the lights are working here we have the horn it is working and let's check the motor now so here we have to turn on the guard forward and now we can see the motor is working under the seat we have the control panel 
where we can control the throttle response. So here we have the slow start function. It is working. Here is the speed restrictor. It is also working and the motor performance. So all is working. We can turn off the quad. And the last step is to remove all the foil from the quad and remove the covers from the stickers. So now the Maddox Deluxe Quad is fully assembled. As you could see, it only takes around 30-40 minutes to fully assemble the quad. This is a top top of the range of electric quad. It's a, the same specification as our Tiger electric dirt bikes. It has neodymium no magnet motor, lithium ion battery and lots of features. So soon we will do full review of this quad. We will also test this quad. So stay tuned, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you like the quad, you can purchase it from our website. The link to our shop is in the description. So thanks guys for watching this short video and see you in the next video.